fans are divided on Meghan Markle's issue of British Vogue. Available today, the September issue of British Vogue Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex, guest edited has fans divided. Keep reading to learn why people either love or hate the issue entitled Forces for Change. In the pages of the magazine, Markle highlighted charities she's become a patron of since joining the British royal family. There's also an interview she conducted with former First Lady Michelle Obama as well as an interview her husband, Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex, did with primatologist Dr. Jane Goodall, among other articles. So, what are fans saying about Markle's issue of British Vogue on Twitter? They like the mirror on the cover. Well, this is something. The mirror idea is pretty cute and you totally know that came from Meghan. Hashtag British Vogue Hashtag September Issue Hashtag Meghan Markle, Nolan Mariana Jomu tweeted. And their happy Markle has remained true to herself even though she's been receiving a lot of criticism about the issue, more on the problems people have with her Vogue issue ahead. I'm just going to sit back and bask in how awesome this woman is. I am sure this will be a wonderful and meaningful at British Vogue issue. Hashtag Duchess of Sussex Hashtag Meghan Markle Hashtag Force of Change, one fan said while another offered brief words of encouragement. To Meghan, keep doing what, sick, you're doing. Others highlighted the fact that Markle is doing what she wants even as a member of the British royal family. I'm also very glad that she is living her life on her own terms while continuing on with her philanthropic work to help create positive change in the world, one Twitter user said. Others were quick to highlight the harsh criticism Markle's received for working with a major magazine, something royals have been doing for years. Princess Diana, Prince Charles, Prince William, and Kate Middleton, Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, and Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex, are among those in the royal family who have posed for magazine covers or taken the role of guest editor. Double standards aside, one Twitter user spoke about what it means for Markle to guest edit the September issue of British Vogue, the publication's biggest and most important issue of the year, along with editor-in-chief Edward N. Enfle. In all caps, they wrote, This September issue is F.I.N.G. legendary. Do you understand this moment? The first black Vogue editor teaming up with the first black duchess to create the September issue showcasing 15 iconic women. Revolutionary. Hashtag British Vogue Hashtag Forces for Change. Fans upset Markle made to get Kate Middleton. One part of the issue fans didn't like is the controversy surrounding the cover. Namely, the fact that Markle didn't appear on the cover because she felt it would be too boastful. Middleton, her sister-in-law posed on the cover of British Vogue as did her late mother-in-law Princess Diana. Ouch. I think Megs has been vv clumsy to say why she didn't want to be boastful and put herself onto the cover considering this dot is most unfortunate, one person tweeted. Then there's the fact Prince Harry said in his interview with Goodall, he and Markle plan on having only two children to be kind to the environment. Another could be dig directed toward Prince William and Middleton who have three children. Defending Markle's decision not to pose for the cover, one fan tweeted the following, Meghan didn't want to be on the cover of British Vogue. She wanted to be the guest editor. She's not just a pretty face. She's a brain. She's a hard worker. She's a boss. Slay. Hashtag Meghan Markle. Others have questioned why Markle didn't include Queen Elizabeth II on the cover. Meghan Markle picks 15 women she admires and doesn't pick the Queen. This is not going well. Hashtag Meghan Markle, a tweet read. Twitter users call Markle hypocritical, selfish, and narcissistic. Some Twitter users felt Markle used her opportunity to guest edit British Vogue as a chance to shine a spotlight on herself, not others. Hashtag Meghan Markle has finally hit narcissism platinum level. I don't think it is actually possible to be more of a narcissist than her. Congratulations Meg. If there was an award for global lifetime achievement in, sick, narcissism, you'd own that award, one person tweeted. Another pointed to Markle's note about advertising in which she wrote the following, There is one caveat for you to remember, this is a magazine. It's still a business, after all. I share that to manage expectations for you, there will be advertising sections that are requisite for every issue, 
So while I feel confident that you'll feel my thumbprint on most pages, please know that there are elements that just come with the territory. Hypocritical much? A Twitter user said referring to Markle's caveat. Another person said Markle's not doing a good job of boosting her public approval. No matter how people feel about the issue itself, it's certainly got people talking.